So my name is Christian, I'm the vehicle control team for Oxford Brooks Racing this year. And I'll be doing multiple different tests for our inverters and our low voltage system to ensure that everything is getting the correct system signal. And for this, I need a high quality multimeter, and we've chosen this RS Components RS9889 multimeter. The multimeter can be used in multiple different scenarios, such as low voltage checking, high voltage testing, and a lot of other electronic scenarios. But not only that, coupled it with the thermal imaging camera, we can actually do a lot of heat testing and heat verification of our motors, for instance, from a former student team, or from exhaust from our previous former student race car. And now we're going to review it for you today. So the multimeter is a true RMS multimeter with the capability of measuring up to a thousand volts and 10 amps. It's got an internal fuse, so if it breaks, you can replace it. And along with two batteries, you'll make sure that you have enough battery life at the racetrack for the whole day. So the multimeter is off right now. To turn it on, you just flick it to any of the different settings on the wheel here, and then the multimeter turns on. The base menu is an auto range menu where you see the different voltages or any of the parameters that you select and the range will automatically change to what you're measuring within the capabilities of the multimeter. In the menu you have multiple different options where you can change the color palette of the thermal imaging camera, you can change the temperature units, the measurement scales, the emissivity of the thermal imaging camera, the recording settings, languages if you don't speak English, setup, time and date, memory and information. The multimeter features an SD card, so you can save the pictures that you take on the device itself, but you can also use Bluetooth to put it to your phone and record it somewhere else. This can be done on iOS or on Android. We turn the multimeter on and open up the ThermView Plus app, available on App Store and iOS. And then we go into the Bluetooth settings and turn it on. And we find the multimeter in here, in the RS9889. And it should come up relatively quickly. There we go, and we connect. And now all the information that's being sent from the multimeter will feature on the phone. So from here, I can take a picture from the app and then it's captured and saved on my phone. This can be very handy in tough environments where you have your phone on you at all times and wants to save it just in case you run out of storage. And that's pretty much it. The multimeter also features a stand on the back so you can set it up on a table along with a flashlight and a laser sensor for the thermal imaging camera. On the back here you can mount the, uh, the measurement points for the multimeter and there's also space for a lanyard if you're going to be using it for long periods of time. 